Flexibility testing is the best way to discover which areas of your client's body are tight and need attention with additional stretches. To measure flexibility, the joint angles are measured at various points while the client holds a stretch. Important flexibility tests for you to remember include the hip flexor or Thomas test, the lying hamstring test, and the shoulder flexion test. The hip flexor test tests two muscles, the iliopsoas and the rectus femoris. Start the test by lying on a bench with your hips right on the edge. Tuck both knees into your chest. Keep one knee into the chest and allow the other leg to extend and relax off the end of the bench. Measure the angle of the femur in relation to the horizontal. If the femur is angled upwards from the hip towards the knee, it signals tight iliopsoas. The lying hamstring test. Have your client lie on the floor with the arms and legs flat and maintain a neutral spine. Have the client lift one leg straight up as far as they can whilst maintaining a straight knee and neutral spine. Measure the angle of the leg in relation to the floor. If the leg flexes to 80 degrees or greater, the measurement is normal. Any measurement less than 80 degrees is considered short. The shoulder flexion test. This test measures the range of movement of the shoulder and will signify tightness in the latissimus dorsi, teres major, rhomboids and trapezius muscles. Have your client lie on the floor in neutral spine with their arms by their sides. Then have them slowly reach their arms overhead, keeping their palms facing upward and the elbows straight. Measure how far the arm travels from the start position. 180 degrees is considered normal. Less than 180 degrees is considered short.